I have a, an important thing to, to present to you, though, Basil. Got an email from okay. Monument to Your Sins, and um, they sent oh. me this uh, <laughs> uh, Indiegogo project called Ukulity Wearable Air okay. Conditioner Cooling Vest. You and, know what? Yeah. Yes. Are you, no, are you going. behind this project or are you the founder? I am, aw- I am aware of the project, yes. Okay. It may have been the same person who sent it to me, okay. but continue. It says, cools the entire body in, in just threes from the back up to 33 degrees Fahrenheit cooler than the Ooh. surrounding temperature. I mean, come on. Yes. And <laughs> I know. They have the video here and... Um, and for those of you watching, it's kind of got like a, it looks like the, the, whatever the Iron Man thing is on his chest, yeah, it's but like it's a on little, the back. Little pod. Yeah, little pod the, oh, thing. <laughs> yeah. But on the front, across the chest, is a little pocket thing. kind of looks like a, I don't know, bulletproof vest kind of thing. It's but like it's a got chest a little, harness. Yeah, a little chest harness, but it's got a little pocket in there. So it's like a fanny pack for your chest. I love it. Yeah. Huge fan. Yeah. It's yeah. Got a, they show a lifeguard wearing it. Yannick. I think this is the future. This is the future, man. I'm totally a huge fan. Uh, somebody did send me this. It may have been the same uh, producer. I I think it's it's interesting you bring this up today because today is the first day in the entire summer for months now that I have not started the show with ice packs or my ice vest completely, you know, blanketing my whole body. For once, it's a little cooler, no ice pack. Now now that we're recording, I'm starting to heat up. I might have to take a second and put it on. Uh, but yeah, I looked at this thing, and I considered getting in on it. However, it's it goes on your back, and it re- has a fan, like it requires airflow. And uh, I sit against a chair, so I didn't think it would actually work very well Yeah, they well haven't thought me. things through, apparently. A lot well, of people it's sit in chairs. It's not, it's not for cooling podcasters. <laughs> well, I, I think I, is the main the main issue. The the idea of personal temperature control is very dystopian, in my opinion. You know, very like smart bodies kind of thing. Like, yeah. oh, it'll control you, and then you'll have your VR mouth thing on, and then your VR headset, and your gloves, and your haptic suit, and. There you go, man. I mean, in the Matrix. I'm not against it, man. I'm not a huge like Indiegogo fan because mm-hmm. I've supported things in the past, and it is possible that they just never show up. Yeah, and you of and you just never get your money back. You never get your item. It's a little bit bit of a problem in the industry there. <laughs> uh, but yeah, you're right, man. It is very suspicious. They, they got the 33, 30, yeah. 33 degrees. 33 degrees. Like you don't even have to go there, but they uh-huh. did. A, Illuminati air conditioning, man. Love it. <laughs> well, thank yeah. you for bringing this to my attention. Mm-hmm. I, I will eagerly await for it to hit the retail market before sure. sending these people any money. 